This is a learning object to help you understand how ANOVA works. The null hypothesis for ANOVA is that the groups you're doing analysis on have the same mean, and the alternative hypothesis is that at least one of the groups has a different mean. And the statistic we use is called the F statistic, and it is measured by um, the variance between the means divided by the variance within the groups. <coughs> and a large F statistic gives more evidence to at least one group having a different mean than the others. So how this learning object works is you manipulate these four groups, and as you do, the F statistic changes in some way. As you move a group uh, groups mean down, away from the grand mean. You notice that the variance between the means increases. And as you move the mean of a group towards the grand mean, you notice that the variance between the means decreases. And as you change the variance within a group, you will notice that the variance within groups decreases. When you decrease the variance within a group, the variance within the groups decreases. And when you increase the variance in a group, the variance within the groups increases. So as you move the mean of a group away from the grand mean, the F statistic gets larger. And when you decrease the variance within a group, the F statistic also gets larger. Notice that if we move all of the means towards the grand mean, we give all of the groups the same mean, then the F statistic is very small, and that makes sense because the null hypothesis is that they, all the four groups have the same mean. But notice that if we change one of the means, or more than one of the means, drastically, we notice that the F statistic gets large, which gives evidence towards uh, there being different means between the four groups. Notice that the grand mean is just the average of all four of these means. And the grand mean doesn't change when the variance within the groups changes. So I hope this tool has helped you understand a little bit more how ANOVA works.